the electric eels at Parramatta. It was a farewell game for two great legends. Michael Cronin and yourself, it was the perfect final curtain, wasn't it? I thought it was better for me to quit the game than to have the game quit me. And, and it was good to go out with the, uh, the Crows. Right. What were you thinking right when Mick Cronin misses that penalty? He's 18 out in front. I'm pretty sure it was a very windy day. Crow just didn't judge it right. to hold, that kick is offline, and it's gone over the dead ball line. A bit of a contentious no try early. Sterler does the chip kick for Brett Kenny. They say the grounding, no good. Yeah, well, the referee wasn't all that crash hot either. What are your thoughts going into the sheds? 2 0 up at half time. Well, 2 0 is like 20 0. We've scored, they've got it. And Crane to growth, growth. Mortimer's after him! Early in the second half, Eric Groth makes a break and it looks like a try to Brett Kenny. He calls a double movement. I'll keep my opinions to myself because that's exactly what the referees did. They were never going to let us score a try. Steve Mortimer makes a break in the 52nd minute. Sturlow does a late tackle and ends up a goal kick to Terry Lamb. Two all. It's a ball game now. 18 minutes to go. David Boyd puts a high shot on you. He did get me in there. In the tackle, but like I wasn't going on. I knew that. Not much time to go, and Phil Sigsworth gets sent off for a high shot on Brett Kenning. What can you say to Phil? The only person to ever be sent off in the grand final. Bulldogs down to 12 men, and they lifted. They were coming at you. They made us earn it um, in, in the last 10 minutes, but uh, I can tell you, there's no way in the world we we're gonna let them in. Jeff Bugden takes out Steve Mortimer off the ball and there's a penalty. Baba, the wind affects him the same as it affects Crow, and that's exactly what happened. Right on the bell, the Bulldogs are on the line, and Michael Mosley is part of a tackle that stops Bugden, and that's the final siren. That's it. And then we started celebrating. Parramatta have won the grand final in 1986. What was the emotion raising that trophy as captain of the 1986 victorious Eels? I was pretty emotional because I got to choose when I left the game.